You got to believe it in order to have it, right? Yeah. Okay, let's finish the drawing. There is no such thing that is, there's an end of studying art. Maybe at that time my motivations no longer just want to be a good painter. And maybe I want the whole world to enjoy the love of painting. When I was four years old, my father brought me to an artist's house. And I was amazed by those beautiful drawing, oil painting, sculpture. So, and then I started to draw every day. And I went back to the artist's house every week for new assignments, for new homework. I dream about becoming an artist. At that time, that was not clear enough to me and I did not have much experience. What is the artist about? I just knew that there is something that really, really attractive. There's something I really, really like to be. So that was the early part of my life that made me want to draw every day uh, and paint every day. Also, I started teaching other people around me. Hello, I'm Yong Chen. I'm an artist, I'm an illustrator, I'm an art professor. Be able to identify the direction for each of your students is very, very huge challenge. Every student at a different stage of their life. Some of them, they did not even know what they wanted to do, what is their own direction. Being a professor, we will be able to share with them with your own experience to point them into the right direction so that they don't have to spend another few years wondering and, and try to figure it out on their own. With your own experience and knowledge, you know what steps they need to take to become what they should be, what they want it to be. They will come to you, they sit down and listen to you, and they would, they would work with you. They go through the journey to define their own direction and became a happy person. But if you feel good, you're doing the thing you like to do every day, that's all matter. They came from different cultural backgrounds. They came from different places, different countries. They have different beliefs, but we're all sharing something in common that is the appreciation for art. And now they put the time into it and want to see the progress every week, every month. And they post the artwork to the community and share with everyone. And they're so passionate about helping other people. Like 20 years ago, you never could imagine that could happen because at that time, the only people I can help is the people next to me because the working schedule, because the time, because the location. Just thinking about in the whole world, how many people out there, they could not drive to the city. They could not know who can teach them. They could not find an art school to go to. If someone really liked art, but they could not see their progress, year by year, the chances they're going to drop it and they're going to regret. And something, something would be very uh, dissatisfied. If I went back to time and start over again, I probably still the same. The only difference, I went through more places. I walked through more jobs, I met more people. I felt there is no difference when I was 20 years old. There's no difference when I was 30 years old. I think I mean to continuously help other people.